Yeah, me. I'm just walking down the middle of the street here in D.C. towards the Capitol because there's no other way to go and trying to get around some of these big-ass puddles in my not really waterproof boots. Sold to me as being waterproof, but they're not at all because they have zippers, you know. But it's kind of fun. It's kind of fun walking around like this. If it weren't for that big plow truck back there, you'd hear what's been amazing me on this whole trip, and that's the uh, sound of actual nature in D.C. It's been kind of creepy being able to hear things like the wind and um, not seeing a bunch of power people walking around with blackberries. That's pretty unusual stuff too. Let's see, how am I going to get around this? Because it's better for me to walk in slush. Because really, it goes everywhere. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. That's quite a river i got to get over here. So yeah, I'm going to be quiet while I attempt to get across this river. Well, that wasn't so bad. It looked a lot more intimidating in person than it actually was. These are some big mounds of snow that they've had to leave behind. I guess one of the biggest problems they're having here right now is where are they supposed to put all this stuff? They're dumping it under bridges all over town and, and then there's a news crew over there hoping for something exciting to happen. I think we're past anything exciting today. Unless of course I get to meet Al Franken. If that happens, Woo! It's coming off this town. See, there's the capital over the snow. All right, going back down. All right, so now I'm at the Russell office building. Senate office building, excuse me. There's two Senate buildings, office buildings. They're right next door to each other. And um, I can never remember where you actually find the publicly accessible entrance, so I'm doing the walk around to do that. Occasionally you see some very important looking people and some very important looking black cars, but otherwise Pretty deadsville. I guess all these all these cars parked over here on the street are all staffers and uh, And senators actually they're probably senators because there's always um the cars with out-of-state plates so you one might assume perhaps that they are actually cars from the states in which these people reside and you see the Sequoia. I'm gonna go Republican on that. Next to the Honda, probably not so much. These are the things you do to keep yourself occupied after being holed up in a hotel room for so many days. So many days. Now if this doesn't work out, we are gonna go over to C-SPAN, I think. We might try Scott Brown's office too, as long as we're over here. He's got Kennedy's old office until until I believe, oh, we're here until the next election. So here we go. Okay, so I've made it into the, the uh, Russell building. Pretty easy. Security people have their dogs with them and such. And I need to be over in the heart building, which I do believe is directly behind me. So I'm gonna have to have to make the turn without looking stupid. Always a challenge. But yes, he's, is, I believe, but Mr. Franken is SH for heart 320. And I'm the SR 162, it's just past Coburn's office a few moments ago. And the ladies' room is temporarily closed because, you know, there are no female senators. All right, there's a couple. Woof. So we always talk a lot about uh, Senate here, and, and appointments are always necessary, but, you know, Today, of course, they're closed here. I could have finally got a Palm Beach crash on it. Oh, look, you actually have to pay. I just passed Senator Sessions. I had a chance I could have gone all Wolverine on him, but I didn't. Damn it! Okay, so I'm in the tunnel going over to the Hart building. But, you know, I stopped into Scott Brown's office, and it just seemed too weird to, to video while I was in there. But remarkably, there were at least 20 people who had volunteered to work in their office. They just didn't have anything to do. Crazy. All right, I'm finally on the same floor with Al Frank, and it's kind of freaking me out. My palms are getting a little sweaty. I don't know if I can uh, 
I don't know if I can do this. I'm freaking out. Shh. Okay, continuing to be a little uh, confused at times. I'm actually in the Durkin building. I thought it was in the Hart building, but I'm gonna keep on trucking here because I think I figured out how to connect. So let's see whose office we've got coming up here. Nobody I want to see. Okay, officially in heart. Could I actually be getting somewhere? There's people out here. I heard a little laughter, therefore Al Franken must be close. Oh, big black sculpture. All right, so we just gave that a go. We went up and the office was closed and I felt all stalkerific and I didn't even have a business card with me anyway, so how stupid was that? I didn't really plan to come down, but here I am, so I'm going to walk back over to Union Station and get on the train and go back. And um, Unless, of course, I get waylaid by stalking Brian Lamb next. It could happen. <laughs>